Hey YouTube, Sandy Frank here. Today I'm doing a very fun video. Uh, I'm going to be showing, well, in my personal top 50, my favorite uh, 50 Star Wars sketch cards. And uh, this is a, a video I'm doing as of 2019. So I'm sure I'll pick up some more during this year and um, um, I'll eventually be doing an updated one, but I want to do a, a top 50 video and uh, show these really awesome sketch cards. The the uh, skill involved in these sketches are just unbelievable. So here's them. Um, they're not, they're kind of in order, but um, I'm just starting like at around number 50 and going up to number one. And um, these are basically my personal favorites. So here's uh, Luke Skywalker. This is by Rob Terracini. Next we have this Captain Phasma sketch. Very nice sketch by R. Molinelli. Next I really like this uh, Princess Leia sketch. Um, just a simple black and white sketch but um, really a uh, nice uh, um, Sketch there, Princess Leia, by Ben Abusadu. And um, this sketch, this is the next one here, a uh, really cool um, Darth Maul sketch from Phantom Menace. And I'm pretty sure this was supposed to be like a, I bet you there's another one right here of Qui-Gon, because you can see his lightsaber there, like the other sketch card should go next to it, like this probably was conceived as a uh, two-part sketch so I'd really like to try to track down the other half of this but, um, that is by Darren Pepe all right next one is this uh, Ray as she's handing the lightsaber um, Luke's lightsaber back over to him um, at the end of um, The Force Awakens and that is by that person. Next, a really cool um, clone trooper sketch. Uh, I'm guessing this is a like Clone Wars era, like Return Revenge of the Sith. Shao Song. Here's a I really like this Jenga Fett sketch. Um, just a, a cool style that it has there. Uh, Brad Hudson did that one. Next we got the great Jab of the Hut, and this is a really cool sketch. Um, a lot of detail in Jabba. His eyes, I really like how he did his eyes. Um, definitely reminds me of Jabba the Hut from um, Return of the Jedi. Andrew Fernandez did that one. There's another um, Return of the Jedi sketch. Um, a Bib Fortuna, just really great detail when a uh, Bib Fortuna looks just like him. Really, really like that sketch. Neil Camera did that one, and here's a sketch of Wedge. Um, this one is by uh, one of my favorite sketch artists, um, Hui Chong, and uh, this is from the Black and White series. Um, he does uh, really good portraits. Okay, now I'm gonna move these over here so I have room. Okay, next we have this uh, really awesome clone trooper sketch here. This is a uh, Mike Mastermaker. I really like this one. I mean, I really love all these, but um, this one's really cool. Uh, Grand Admiral Thrawn from Rebels. Uh, just fantastic. Uh, Matt Langford did that one. This one, it, it kind of, at first I was like, eh, that's not real detailed, but man, there is some very fine um, skill involved there. As you can see the smoke in the background, this great scene um, from Empire Strikes Back. The shading on the figures is really, really good. Um, Subtle but very awesome. This was a, a really good sketch of Darth Vader and Luke. This is one of the 
the first sketch cards I ever pulled was uh, this one. I really like this one still. Um, with the Boba Fett there with Han Solo and Carbonite by Scott Jones. Oh, I didn't show the uh, artist on this one. That was Eric Lettinen. Sorry about that. I'm going to try to show the artist on all these. Next we have a Clone Wars sketch. Um, and of course this is Cad Bane. When I first pulled this I could not remember the name of that character. But um, really great Cad Bane sketch. Um, Jeff Abar did that one. This is one of the few sketch cards that I've actually bought. Um, picked this up in Kansas when I went out of town on a uh, trip. And um, saw it and I definitely wanted to pick it up. C-3PO. Um, really great shading on C-3PO. Very lifelike looking. Dave Gaskin did that one. There's another great sketch of Lama Sue. Um, just uh, really like the way he uses various, various colors of, of gray and black. Uh, Callan Archer did that one. This one, it was pointed out by um, um, one of the, uh, the viewers of the video where I pulled this, that this is probably another one that is a puzzle sketch. Because as you can see, there's Kylo Ren with his uh, lightsaber right there. And there's probably another piece that goes right here, which would make a, and there might even be some up here because there's like some of the um, battle going on up there. But I bet you it's a two piece. And um, of course, this is, I love sketch cards that show a scene from the movie. And that's, of course, a great scene from Last Jedi. Nick Alsopy did that one. Alsop. It's Alsop, not Alsopy. <clears throat> Whoa. All right, next we have this uh, really awesome sketch of that singer from. The special edition of uh, Return of the Jedi in Jabba's Palace. I just really like that sketch. Definitely uh, no mistaking that character. Another Darren Pepe sketch. This sketch is so good of one of the caretakers from The Last Jedi. I mean, almost, it's kind of hard to see on camera, but it almost like looks 3D. I mean, they did such a good job on that sketch. It's a great caretaker sketch. Ryan Finley did that one. So that, now we're getting into the top 30. So this one, of course, is one of my favorite uh, Star Wars characters, Ahsoka. And this is from Clone Wars. Just really like how they did it um, with the green lightsaber there. And it's like reflecting back onto her face. Really cool. Brad Hudson did that one. Next, this one was from uh, the uh, Black and White A New Hope um, cards. Uh, really awesome Obi-Wan Kenobi sketch. Um, old Obi-Wan. I always love sketch cards that have lightsabers in it. That one's really neat by Marsha Dye. This one, I just got this one in recently in an online break. Um, really cool sketch of the skiff guard. Or not skiff guard, but the, uh, the Jabba skiff ship from Return of the Jedi. And that is by Jay Malian. Um, the next one right here is, uh, I pulled this from a loose pack that I picked up um, from local hobby shop over here. And uh, it's kind of like a painting. Um, again, I love the ones that show like a scene, not just a portrait. But this is a scene from the movie from uh, Attack of the Clones. It's a really goofy scene in the movie of Anakin riding one of those uh, creatures. But I, it, for some reason, I really like this sketch. It uh, makes me smile. Jay mentioned that one. Um, here's a really nice uh, Han Solo sketch. Um, 
just it takes a lot of skill to do portrait sketches and that one's Dan Turley did that one it's another really nice uh, portrait sketch of uh, uh, Qui-Gon um, of course um, the great Liam Neeson plays him and that is by Phil Hassowy This is a really, really good um, Sand Trooper sketch. Um, if you can notice, like, the detail, like, even, like, all the little stitchings on those, uh, the bandages, the head wrappings, um, the little tattered edges. I mean, is it, whoever did, I don't know, we know who did it, but the, the person that did this, you can't just, I just can't imagine how long it took to get all that detail in that picture. That was a Callan Archer sketch. This next one is really cool. I really enjoy this uh, sketch artist's work. Um, this awesome close-up of uh, Darth Vader and his helmet. And that is um, Muhammad Jelani did that one. This one is a really, really good um, Wicket the Ewok sketch from Return of the Jedi. I have a lot of Return of the Jedi sketches that I really enjoy, I guess. But this one, really awesome detail. Um, I, what really gets me are, are the eyes. The eyes really uh, capture um, what they really look like in the movie. Um, Tom Amici. Is that one? Next one, uh, this is a uh, Carlos Caballero sketch. Uh, Captain Phasma. Really cool. Um, just really enjoy it. Um, the look of that sketch, Carl Scavalero. He does a lot of really good sketches for Star Wars. All right, now we're getting to the top 20 here. Here's a really awesome Stormtrooper sketch here. Um, I really like the use of the blue in that. And it's Ronnie Crowther did that one. And next one, this is a, uh, a sketch by Lee Brown. Um, I picked this one up from eBay. Um, someone from Hong Kong was selling this. I've been trying to get one of uh, Lee's sketches. Um, just a really great pencil sketch. I think it's pencil. Might be like a gray paint or gray, um, whatever the, the, uh, the pen or whatever it was that they use. I think it's pencil. Like combination of pencil and paint, maybe. Of uh, Luke Skywalker. Uh, this next one is a die cut. And a lot of the die cuts, the die cuts are cool, but they don't really seem to go with what the die cut is. With this one, obviously, Darth Vader helmet die cut and just a great Darth Vader sketch there. That is by M. James. Next one, this is one of the first sketches I ever pulled from a pack also. Um, another Darren Pepe. This is a Sabine. Uh, really cool sketch. There's Darren Pepe. Next one, another uh, really cool Captain Phasma sketch. Um, just again, really nice detailing. All the wear on the helmet and stuff is very cool. John Bruce did that one. Here's a really awesome Chewbacca sketch. Uh, done in black and white. Uh, really, this is, this is the best Chewbacca sketch I've seen. It's really nice. Um, Frank Samsoni. Um, this is a uh, really nice sketch here. This is a famous, uh, one of the big sketch artists. Anyway, I, I think they are. Um, Andrew Fry did this. Uh, Jen Urso. Really like his uh, the style of sketches that he does. Andrew Fry. <clears throat> this is another really, really good. All these sketches are so good. Uh, Kylo Ren. Um, this is a... Another really great pencil sketch. Uh, Keith Carter did that one. This 
this sketch is almost looks like a picture of uh, this AT AT uh, from uh, Empire Strikes Back. Uh, it's a great sketch. Love the uh, real subtle landscaping in the background. Um, let's see if I can get the light. Oh, that's just right. Just such a great sketch. Um, James Saint. James Horn Saint or something like that. Um, this next sketch. Love this Plocoon sketch. Um, the mask, the detail on that mask is so good. Get a close up of that. Just uh, so much detail in that mask. And I uh, really love this sketch. And that is by Alex Mines. Alright, so now we're getting to the top 10, my top 10 favorite sketches. Of course, if you don't know what, um, what sketches are, these are actually one of one pieces of art. And um, you can get them in boxes of Star Wars cards. Um, and uh, they're not just like regular cards. These are actually pieces of original art. <clears throat> and this is a... Uh, really really good padme sketch and um what re i really love it like just captures her eyes so well it's a great sketch i really have no idea whose signature that is but they did an awesome job um here's a really awesome princess leia sketch um just uh what really stands out is the amount of detail like just the, the way they did the, her, her hair. It was so good. Muhammad Jelani. Another one of his sketches. And this is another Keith Carter sketch. Really awesome sketch of Ray. Um, just the amount of detail on her face is so good. Just like in her eyes and everything. Some really good pencil sketch artists. Keith Carter. This sketch is probably one of the, the uh, last ones that I've picked up. Got this um, in a hobby box of Masterwork. Uh, Qui-Gon, just, just a masterpiece. I mean, just can't imagine how long it took this person to do this sketch. Just so well done. Magnificent. Um, Angel Abilis did that one. All right, here's another Princess Leia sketch. Um, I just love this sketch. Another Koi Trung sketch. Um, but just a, the use of the colors is just really well done in that. <clears throat> this is my favorite Stormtrooper sketch. It's uh, one of the First Order Stormtroopers. Uh, you can, this is like you can practically see reflection in the visor. Just so good. Like, I just wish I could do anything close to that. There is the artist. And we have this uh, Boba Fett sketch. Like, just you can just tell. Look at all the detail in the helmet. Um, this took someone a long time to uh, put together. Uh, just a great sketch. Steve Alsey did that one. Now we're down to the last three. This sketch, I actually got this one in a card crate. Um, or no, yeah, card crate. Just like an add-on pack of uh, Star Wars cards and pulled this sketch out of it and it is fantastic. Um, at first I was like, well, it kind of looks kind of interesting, but it's the style of it is so unique. And uh, just so captures uh, Emperor Palpatine. That's by Loco Duck. He does a lot of cool sketches. <clears throat> this one, I actually picked this up in Kansas. Also, this is a just a phenomenal um, sketch from Empire Strikes Back. I love that galaxy in the background; just really pops. Of course, um, you got Luke and Leia, and again, it's a a scene from the movie not just a portrait of somebody and that's by Ward Silverman and my favorite sketch card has to be 
this one um, just beautiful sketch of Jen Urso um, by Stephanie Rosales she even uh, put the name there for Jen Urso she wrote her name out and signed it so she's very proud of this one and definitely you can see why it's just a wonderful sketch and uh, I looked into some of her other sketches and she has a, definitely has a really unique style and um, she does some great sketches but I love this one so stay tuned for more videos hope you enjoyed this uh, um, top 50 sketch cards of my sketch card collection and um, I just wanted to share them with everybody all right stay tuned for more videos